Oh, hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So for the vlog today, I wanted to show you guys a bit of what our life was like when we were in Crete. As you guys saw at the beginning, I was a full-fledged mermaid for a whole week and I wanted to show you guys a bit of my day to day and also the grounds of the hotel because it was truly beautiful. I'm going to show you the grounds of the hotel to show you where the pool is as well as where the restaurant slash cafe slash bar is which is where I got my iced coffee every single day. Except in Greece they didn't call it an iced coffee, they called it a frappe which is something that I enjoyed every morning or afternoon or sometimes both and I enjoyed it on the beach listening to the waves and just drying off in between mermaid sessions. I also read a few books when I was on the beach which was fantastic as well. My days in Crete basically consisted of having breakfast, grabbing a frappe or iced coffee and then enjoying it on the beach, then going to swim for several hours at some point, getting hungry for lunch, having lunch on the beach then going back into the water to splash around for several more hours. After that, I would go back to the hotel and then I would shower, clean up, do some makeup and then go out for dinner. I'm gonna show you guys a little makeup tutorial of basically how I did my makeup when we would go out for dinner in Crete. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, different setup, yeah. There was a moped zooming by. So I am in Greece, I am in Crete. It's a palm tree right there. I am on the balcony of our hotel and I've spent the day at the beach getting sun damage. <laughs> um, but I've been wearing lots of SPF, but still, I mean, I'm in Greece, so like I'm not gonna not go to the beach. So yeah, and I thought we're gonna go for supper later tonight, so I thought we could do a little makeup look. And yes, my hair is very wet. I washed it because it was very well needed. So yeah, and also, so I packed my makeup because I, sh I showed you guys the video of like makeup that I take with me when I travel, and I realized that the compacts that I took don't have mirrors. So I'm actually using the screen on the camera to film and also to uh, see what I'm doing because uh, my husband's in the room sleeping and I don't really want to film in the bathroom while he's sleeping and also the lighting isn't like amazing so I kind of feel like this setup is like more cool I don't know it's more different and authentic and I feel like I have a little oh, look at that look at that tan line look at that sun damage I know I know it's so bad but I'm also like so excited well whatever I mean Quebec is not known for sunshine so I feel like while you know when in Rome oh wait I was like when in Rome no, no Rome is in Italy I know things I swear so yeah, when in Crete, do as the Cretans? That can't be right. Cretians? Do as the Greeks do, I guess. Yeah. Hopefully the sound and lighting is good. I feel like the lighting is pretty good now, so hopefully it stays. You will see if the sun starts to set, you will see a natural progression. So I'm gonna go ahead and do a little bit of primer. This is the Dior Air Flash right here. Let me just show you guys this one here. Give this a shake. Wet beauty sponge. Dab, dab, dab. Let's go ahead and do a brow. So this is the Benefit Brow Contour. I don't know if my review of this came up yet or not because I filmed a bunch of videos beforehand so I wouldn't have to film while I was on vacation. So hopefully you guys have seen this review. This does not have a spoolie and I forgot to pack a spoolie. Shoot. Shoot. Okay, well, wish me luck. I have a concealer brush, so I'm just gonna wing it and do that. I also didn't bring any tweezers, so, but I mean, if I don't have a mirror, then I can't really tell what my eyebrows look like, can I? 
So the hotel we're staying at, it's called the Golden Bay. I think it's a chain of hotels. Um, I'd never stayed in one before, so I booked online. And I was just like, the photos looked really nice online, so I was just like, please, fingers crossed, let this be a good hotel, and it's so pretty. Imagine my eyebrows are so bad that even my husband notices. That's bad. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and highlight a little bit. Oh my god, this highlight is all over the place. I can't talk and do eyebrows, clearly. I'm done. Ready for grease. Um, so the, fo oh, sorry, put my elbow on the table. The tri I have like a mini tripod that's on top of an upside down coffee pot in order to get this angle, so there we go. So um, these bobby pins are stuck to my foundation. This is the Gucci Westman Atelier foundation. I got these little like sleeves to put the product in and it's metallic, so as you can see, it's full of bobby pins. Life hack, get something metallic in your makeup bag so that you can find your bobby pins. So I think these eyebrows look okay. Hard to tell. All right, foundation. I've been having so many breakouts lately. It's kind of crazy. So this is brand new. This is the sunblock here. This is the sunblock with SPF in it. I've never used it. I didn't even read the instructions, so uh, hopefully I can figure it out. I think you have to turn it. Probably should have read the instructions. But why would I do something like that? So obviously there's product down here. I'm like just like, I'm supposed to shake it out? You know what, I'm just gonna do my concealer and then I'm gonna worry about that after. Avoiding your problems in life. It's great. Just kidding, don't do that. So I'm gonna go into my concealer. This is the Clé de Peau concealer. This one has SPF in it, which is great. I feel like I have hair somewhere on my face that I can like, you know when you can't see it, but you can feel it. Just like whispering across your face. Damp beauty sponge. I'm just gonna go back into my concealer. Just I'm gonna like brighten this whole area up here. I hope I'm blending everything well. I hope the lighting is good. I hope the sound is good. We'll see. And then I checked the weather. So today was absolutely beautiful. It was like it was a hot day. It was really hot. But you know, when you're at the beach, it's fine. But I checked the weather and tomorrow's supposed to rain. I'm like, excuse me? That is uh, not acceptable. <laughs> but we were in Barbados last year and whenever it would say it would rain, it would literally just like drizzle for 20 minutes and then be done. So I'm really hoping that's what happens here. I'm gonna pause you for a second so I can Google how to open this. Excuse me. It's me again, I figured it out. So yeah, you have to twist the bottom. Okay, I did it a minute ago when I was off camera. There we go. So you just twist to open and then there's product. I don't really see anything, but it's open. Okay. Don't forget that neck. And then I'm gonna close it. There we go. So it doesn't really feel like it did anything. Hopefully this works. I'm gonna go into some bronzer now. I'm gonna go ahead and use, this is the Dior Backstage Contour Palette. There we go. I am going to use the lightest shade, this one here. I almost used the highlighting side. That would be uh, not ideal. Imagine I go inside and like my makeup looks like beyond insane. I'm just like everywhere. <laughs> that would be pretty funny actually. I'll let you know if that happens. I'm gonna go extremely lightly into the darker one because like the darker one is quite dark and uh, like I mentioned, I'm not sure how the lighting is or what this actually looks like right now. I'm gonna use some as blush as well because I've been to the beach all day, so might as well look extra golden. Bobby pins, anyone? There's a lot of mopeds around. Also a lot of smokers, no offense. I'm gonna go ahead and use my Gucci Westman um, this is the foundation stick, I've already used that. I need the blush. Should I pack the blush? Yes, I did. Oof. Also covered in bobby pins. I'm gonna go ahead and use this blush here. It's really pretty and like corally. So I think it's good for a beach vacation. So we're gonna be here from, well, we got here on Monday night, like super late, and today's Tuesday. So we're here until Saturday. And then after that, we're going to Athens. So it's quite exciting. My husband definitely does not love the beach as much as I do, so I'm 
very lucky that he would do a beach vacation even though he doesn't really like it so I'm very grateful he's a very good husband so after the beach vacation we're gonna to go to Athens which is fun because we both love like ancient history and ruins we both love museums and things like that that's like a really fun vacation for us so we're gonna do that for another week whatever's left on the brush I'm just gonna like do this really quick I'm gonna take my wet sponge and just go over here. I feel like the blush is like too high a little bit. I'm really going for like a very natural, very like no makeup makeup look, even though I'm like bothering to put on makeup. I'm gonna go in with some highlighter now. This is also the Dior Backstage palette. This is the face palette. It's called like the Glow palette, which means it's glowy. I'm gonna go ahead and use the gold one because I like gold. So I'm like um, Austin Powers in that gold number when he's like, I like gold. Yeah, I'm old, I know. This is a great reference. I feel like that you can definitely see. And then using my finger, I'm gonna go into the copper shade. I'm probably not gonna like have my makeup on for that long, so I'm not gonna bother with a base for this because, I don't know, I'm only on vacation right now, so like I'm not that concerned. I'm going into the white shade, and I'm gonna place that in the middle. That is super white. I'm gonna have to blend that out. And now I'm gonna go into this Dior um, Iconic Over Curl Mascara. Mascara makes such a difference. Okay, I think I'm gonna do a little bit of lipstick. For the lip, I'm gonna go into my Chanel Eau Rouge Coco, number 440. This one is called Arthur. I love doing like no makeup makeup look and then like a bold lip. I feel like when you have more minimal makeup, you can get away with like a really bright lip. Very windy. Ah! Palm tree says hi. I'm just gonna go into my concealer and just dab a little bit on my breakouts. Okay, I think this is it. This is the makeup look. This is like a no makeup makeup look with a beautiful bold lip and some curly floofy hair. What is this curl doing? What is that? I don't know. Anyway, thank you guys so much for stopping by. I hope you guys um, had a good day. Let me know down in the comments what you guys want to see next, any reviews, tutorials. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed my makeup tutorial and also seeing the grounds of the hotel. It was truly beautiful, especially if you are a mermaid like me. Thank you so much for stopping by. Have a great day. Make sure to like and subscribe and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.